Good morning. Hope you're doing well this morning. I want to read you scripture in 2 Corinthians 5 verse 17. It says these words, Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has gone, the new has come. Now I want to tell you a story what I've heard. This person, uh, he was speaking on, on these men's camps and uh, he was talking about himself, about his past and, it, and how he cheated on his wife and where he did it. And, and he gave a lot of, too, kind of too much info. And then uh, after the, his whole talk, the, the guy that, that organized the camps uh, went to him and said, listen, it was wonderful that you did, but don't you think you gave too much information about yourself, too much info? Um, don't you think that people will think bad of you because of the things you've did? He said, listen, no, stop, stop, stop. The person that I talked about, that person is dead a long time ago. He is dead. He is buried. He is gone. Because a person who is in Christ now, I'm a new creation. The person that's saying this, I'm a new creation. That person that I talked about, he is gone. I'm standing in front of you as a new creation. That's why I can talk in such a fashion about that guy because he is dead he is buried I'm standing here as a new creation and none of those things is part of my life that's what it means to be in Christ and this the old is gone the new has come I'm a new creation when we say we are in Christ we know that the old life is gone, it's dead, it's buried. It's not alive anymore. And the new creation has arrived and new has come. That's why we can say, I am new in Christ. Amen. Let us pray together. Lord, thank you that we are a new creation in you. Well, thank you, the old is gone and the new has come. And we are standing here this morning as a new creation because of Jesus Christ within us. Amen.